A fail is an opportunity. Hi everyone, Angus Pry here, multi-award winning practice growth specialist. Here is my golf club. Look, it's broken. I'm at the shop now to try and get it fixed. And the irony is I didn't do anything special. I didn't wrap this around a tree or it was none of that. I was out of a practice range, just having a few shots and for whatever reason, it just fell off. Now, these clubs are reasonably new and the reality is for any of us in business that when things do go wrong, and unfortunately it's an inevitable part of being in business, that is not the end of the story. I've listened to a couple of people talking about this lately where in some ways a fail can be the start of an even greater connection but it depends how you respond. A guy called Alex Hormosi I was listening to, he was talking about they went to a restaurant and it was the service was very bad and it took a long time and then they let the manager know and they went over and above. They, I think they gave him a discount on their meal, they gave them extra stuff. And his point was, it's not enough just to give a refund of this bad service, but to actually do extra. And then he described another situation where a company had failed and then they just wouldn't take responsibility. But what I've heard separately from others is that when you do go extra, when you do go above and beyond, that's where you can get someone to go from being a sort of relatively happy customer to being a raving fan. So just remember, my friends, a fail is an opportunity. How will you respond? See ya.